In this video, I'm going to share some of the best freelance platforms that you can use to make some money, extra income for yourself if you are a creator, especially if you are a designer. And this is coming up. Hi everybody innocent and welcome to the channel over here we make videos like this if that is something that sounds like you are interested kindly consider subscribing so basically a freelance job is where one person works for themselves rather than for a company and so therefore a freelancer is a person who is self-employed and not necessarily committed to any particular employer long term so basically if you're a freelancer let's say you are a graphic designer you are going to offer your services you're going to create designs for other people from different kinds of the world and then you are going to get paid for that so here are some of the best freelance platforms that you can start with so let's start off with fiverr fiverr is a platform that has been in existence since 2010. it is one of the biggest platforms if not the biggest at all and i personally have been on fiverr for the past four years and i've made over three thousand dollars as a side income working from fiverr now fiverr is a gig based website you can realize from here that there are people here that are selling their services for five dollars ten dollars fifteen dollars and it can go up to thousands of dollars now i know fiverr has its downsides that because it starts from five dollars sometimes you don't really make enough money but that is not true people actually start their gigs with five dollars because they want to gain trust and after that they can increase their value to thousands of dollars when it comes to the services that you can offer there are hundreds of them starting from graphics and design digital marketing writing and translation up to a whole lot of them business and lifestyle and when you pick any one of them there are subcategories under it for instance under the graphic design you have logo and brand identity you have web and app design visual design print design so you can design t-shirts flyer design brochure poster and then logo design website design and a whole lot of them so you realize that picking the graphics and design alone you have about 50 or so categories under them and then you can move to the other subsection digital marketing writing and translation for instance copywriting resume writing and then a whole lot of them now the beauty of our fiverr is that you're not limited to just one of them when you pick or if you're a graphic designer you can be a logo designer and at the same time you can be designing poster and flyer it all depends on your specialty and what you want to do on the platform if you are new on Fiverr or if you want to join, you can simply go to fiverr.com. I'll leave links in the description. You click on join, you follow the procedure, and then you are going to be welcomed on Fiverr. It is free of charge. You don't have to pay anything. And then if you want to see a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to register for Fiverr, let me know in the comment section as I'll walk you through that. Once you become a seller, you can create what we call gigs. So here are some of my gigs over here. So you can you realize from here that I can provide services for obituary makeup design check design and another obituary and then i have one gig for facebook marketing as well so these are the gigs that people can search me for and these are the gigs that people can other services from so once you become a seller you can create some of these gigs and then you can start selling those gigs for money and then once you get upgraded to level one level two you can also create new gigs or additional gigs so for a beginner, I'm limited to about five or so gigs. But when you upgrade to a different level, you are going to be able to create a new gig as well. So Fiverr is a great platform that you can generate a lot of money from as a side hustle. And you can work with different people from the whole of this world. Check in the description for a link to sign up for Fiverr for free. Next on the list is 99designs.com. Remember, all the links will be in the description if you want to join any of these platforms. Now, this is a world-class design platform that you can generate or you can apply for gigs up to over $1,000. Now, I personally did a video with one of a creator from Ghana who actually bargains for projects worth $1,000 as a graphic designer. You can check this video if you want to watch that interview so this is how 99 designs work you apply for a project so somebody will drop i want to create a flyer design and then you are going to apply for that project couple with other freelancers and then you are all going to make your designs and then you are going to submit it so it is more or less like a contract and who is going to win it so you you submit your design and then the person who ordered the design or 
any other thing is going to make the choice one downside with 99 designs that i really don't like is the fact that sometimes you spend a whole lot of time trying to create something very awesome and at the end of the day the buyer is going to choose something way below belt and then it looks as if your all your time has gone wasted or something but then it all depends on your skill and how you present your works in the final round and then because it is a competitive type of website the payment is way higher so you can get a contract as huge as one thousand dollars per project but then of course it demands a lot of works and sometimes you'd have to try about five proposals before you can get like one of them so it is worth the time i know people who have been working personally it is not my thing over here i've never done a job on this platform but then i know people who have made five thousands and ten thousands of dollars from this website so you can give it a try who knows you might be the next big star on 99designs.com moving on we have upwork formerly known as elance odesk which has been in existence since the 2005s as odesk and then recently in 2015 it was converted to upwork now this is one of the best platforms that also generates a lot of money i've had a couple of works done in upwork now upwork basically combines fiverr and then 99designs.com because sometimes you have to send proposals and then of course other times people can reach out to you especially if you are bringing them out from let's say social media other social media platform so over here quite similar to fiverr you have different categories that you can work on and then you have the development and it creative and design sales and marketing writing and translation and a couple of them now upwork in the mainstream has been categorized as one of the pro freelance websites so people come here to post a job and then you have to create a proposal and when you're accepted you get to work with all clients from different parts of the world and as you can see here, Upwork is trusted by some leading brands like Microsoft, Airbnb, and GoDaddy. Now, since Upwork is considered as kind of the pro type of website, one of the few issues that people have is getting signed up onto Upwork because they, it goes through a lot of scrutiny before you are accepted onto the platform. But once you are accepted, there is a probability that you are going to make some huge money from this website so if you want to sign up you just click on the sign up here and then you're going to follow all the prompts you're going to sign up as a freelancer not someone who is a client hiring for a project so you're going to click on the freelancer and then you're going to follow the procedure to sign up as a freelancer let me know in the comment section if you don't want to see the step-by-step -step procedure on how to sign up on upwork and how to get approved on upwork i'll be glad to share that experience with you as well now let's move on to the next one the next website we look at is freelancer.com this is an australian freelance website that was established in 2009 and then it has been in existence since then now for a, a specified freelance website like this you can sometimes if you are a person like me in ghana sometimes you can't work over there but then of course if you use you, you have your ways around it you understand so you can use your vpns and all that to maneuver your way around it it's very similar to the previous freelance platforms that we've looked at and then this is one website that has been used by these amazing big companies amazon facebook nasa and then google so you know that this platform is one huge platform that you can actually make some huge money from now similar to 99designs.com people come here to post proposals and then freelancers will apply for it so this package design cost $280 in four days so someone is looking for a person who designed a package design for them in four days for $280 so if you've signed up as a freelancer you can click on this particular project and then you can apply for this particular project there are similar ones just like you see over here a mobile design for $600 in four days and a wordpress design for $45 in one day so any one of them according to your specialty you can apply for projects from this area and then you can work on them and generate some money on this platform as well next on the list is toptal founded in 2010 toptal is one of the best platforms that you can also work as a freelancer over there it is basically known as the top three percent because it is quite difficult to get in here because you have to have the skill and you have to prove a lot so people actually find it very difficult to sign up for top tau now for the categories you have developers designers finance experts and then project managers product managers and 
so on and so forth if you have any skill in any of these areas you can basically sign up for top tile and then you can sell your services for money it is trusted by duolingo shopify and bridgestone and some amazing big companies so you can apply as a freelancer by clicking on the apply as a freelancer here or if you've signed up already you can click on login now the beauty of this one is you can easily log in with your linkedin account and just to let you know linkedin is just an extra okay linkedin is one of the best platforms if you want to be working on this freelance platform so if you have linkedin you can easily sign up with linkedin without necessarily have to go through the whole procedure of creating a new account so you just click on sign in with linkedin and if you have your linkedin sign in it is going to take you to top tile and then you can basically start providing your services for money the last platform that we're looking at today is guru.com now guru is loki one of the few platforms and it is not that top notch it is the least among all the platforms that i've showcased so far because it has a lot of things to be worked on and you know because guru is very free and easy to sign up you can see that there are over 305,000 plus freelancers working on programming and development so you realize from here that guru is one of the very competitive freelance platforms but of course like i say always it depends on your talent and it depends on the rate at which you can work you can still sign up for guru and then get some works up now once you sign up for guru one thing that i've realized from this platform is they constantly keep reminding you of the number of jobs available for your specialty so if you sign up they, you constantly receive emails of some jobs available in your field so you can easily trace that and then work on guru i personally haven't created any job over here but i signed up of course i was testing it out so but i've not actually made any sales over here but it is a great platform for especially beginners that you can sign up and make some money from these platforms there are a couple of other freelance websites like people pay are there are fiverr pro and a couple of other websites i'll leave most of the links in the description as well as all the platforms that i talked about so find in the description all the links and then try any one of them and let me know your thoughts in the comment section i hope this video was helpful if it was and subscribe to the channel would be so very much appreciated and let me know in the comment section if you want to be seeing more of such videos thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next video it's innocent here and bye